You wait. Uh, that covers up you my wait. side. You over yet? Wow. Gracious, a derrick. A derrick, sir. Oh, my word, sir. You forgive me speaking to you without an introduction. She's beautiful, sir. Beautiful. This is the first guy I've ever owned, sir. A derrick. Aristocrats, all of them. But uh, there's not a scratch on I wish you were new. But I knew. I, I'm sorry, sir. You'll have to excuse me. It's the first car that I ever owned, sir. A derrick. I'm sorry, sir. You'll have to excuse I me. I never believed it possible. Uh, if you knew the pleasure it gives me to see this wonderful car and so wonderfully kept it. He's always too good. Uh, I wish my wife was here. Yes, sir. It, will you know it's in a derrick exactly like this one that I asked my wife to marry me? 1904, so it was, Pangborn. And she said yes, but oh, it was the car. I'm sure of that, it was the car. Yeah, I hope I'm not holding you up. Not at all, sir. I knew there were chaps like you, you know, keeping up these old cars. We don't get about as much as we used to, you know? No. Look, perhaps you'd like me to come over and I'll give you a drive in the sometime. But, uh, do you mean to say, but that's very kind. Would you really do that? I, I simply can't tell you. Wait a moment, I'm sure I've got a card. Your wife might like to come, too. You can take the wheel yourself, if you like. I say, sir. That... Tomorrow evening? Yeah, tomorrow? Oh, I'm very grateful, sir. Very grateful, indeed. Good day, sir. Good day, madam. Good God day. bless you. God bless you. Wonderful old man, wasn't he? Oh, Alan. What's the matter? What are you crying about? Oh, darling, when you just sat there, when you just sat there, and I knew what you were thinking. And I knew you wouldn't just drive away and leave him. Come on, Wendy. You know I don't like to see you cry. But you've lost her. You've lost Genevieve. <laughs> I'll survive. Oh, darling, I'm so sorry. Wendy, stop it, will you? There's no reason to cry. I mean, a bet's a bet. I wouldn't have made it if I hadn't been prepared to lose. But Genevieve means more to you than, than anything. You know she does. <laughs> Nonsense. <laughs> You'll give him the money instead. Promise me you will. Wendy, be sensible. Promise me. I shall hate myself for the rest of my life. We'll talk about it. No. No, you can always talk me into anything. Say you will. Well, if... Say it. All right. But it'll leave us practically penniless. Who cares about that?